There is nothing to repair when it comes to the medical transfers of sick people from regional processing countries to Australia. This bill is working and it delivers on a core Australian principle, which is that if you are sick, no matter who you are, no matter what your race, no matter what your wallet, you get medical care. Medivac laws have the support from this broad range of people, community groups and experts, because the laws are working well. The Medivac laws are ensuring that sick people get the medical care that they need. In the face of repeated false claims by Minister Dutton about Medivac, Labor has not yielded. Labor has insisted that Medivac is necessary and is working. Those on the other side seem to think you can't protect our borders and be compassionate at the same time. A deal between the Morrison Order. government and Senator Lambie to drive a stake through the heart of Medivac, and they're keeping it secret from this parliament and from the Australian public. Without the full details of this secret deal, how on earth can senators cast a vote? This is a deal that will remove life-saving medical transfer provisions for people in PNG and Nauru. If senators are to repeal Medivac without any knowledge of the deal, they are voting blind. This chamber has every right to stand up and demand that any details of the deal that's been done uh, should be provided to this chamber. Absolutely. We should be allowed to debate it. We've all seen enough of this government to know they ran through legislation without any concern for transparency. They don't care if people have seen what we're voting on. And this legislation is about the lives of vulnerable and sick people. And it appears to have been decided in secret and out of public view, away from any scrutiny. We're supposed to now vote on legislation on the basis of arrangements that no one has seen. The media hasn't seen them, I assume. The federal cabinet hasn't seen them, and the Senate hasn't seen them. When forcing the Medivac repeal bill through the Senate, the minister told the Senate, and I quote, there is no secret deal. But 20 minutes later, Senator Lambie told the Senate, and I quote, I put up to the government a proposal to work with me to secure my support for the passage of the repeal of Medivac. I genuinely can't say what I proposed. Which statement is correct? These statements are actually not inconsistent with each other. There is absolutely no secret deal.